All right, it is Thursday afternoon. I uh, am going to a conference day after tomorrow, so I'll be packing and getting myself ready and you know after today. So this is like my Friday. Um, we have uh, two guinea pigs in from a uh, an accidental referring vet. It's actually a second opinion. It turns out that the one you're looking at right there actually has um, a pretty severe and chronic sinusitis. He's been on a uh, double sulfa drug for how long now? A week. A week. Okay. Um, client says they made an improvement at the very beginning, but it, uh, they didn't just got chronic again and the same exit it was coming out. What we thought was kind of weird when I was getting the history is if it were bacterial, then how come this guy isn't sick as well? So anyway, uh, at that point in time, I knew it was time to do a cytology. So I actually did get some, uh, some boogers. It took me a few minutes of tickling the nose to actually get a, a, enough exudate to put under a microscope slide. The cytology showed that it was chock full of white blood cells, um, definitely showing a sign of infection. I think I saw like maybe three small strips of strep and only about two or three organ organisms in a line at that point in time. And then the, uh, I actually saw some budding yeast, some fungal hyphae and some other fungal elements that were in there as well. So chances are Roberta Harris actually got a fungal infection. Dun, 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 dun. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I get paid for this. Um, <laughs> so we're going to start him on some antifungals. Uh, because of his size, I've actually chosen ketoconazole uh, today. And we're going to go ahead and get him started. Uh, the bad news is, Mom, when it comes to, to fungal infections, the uh, me mechanisms, the, the, the drugs that we use actually stop their, their metabolic mechanisms and keep them from, from reproducing. It doesn't really kill them. So we might not be seeing a big improvement. Today is Thursday until about Saturday or Sunday or maybe even as late as Monday. Okay. okay. Um, but we should, you know, you should start seeing this improvement, you know, by that time. Okay. okay so that's pretty much how that works. Um, our buddy here is actually quite photogenic, although he's not really doing much else than, you know, just <laughs> saying hi. What's up? I know. What are you saying? Can I play with your nose some more? Oh, yeah. You liked that before. Like this guy. <laughs> so anyway, um, I'd like to uh, about the same time next week. Okay, either a phone call saying, "Doc, you nailed it. You did great, so I won't lose any sleep." Or let's bring him back so I can listen to him and make sure it hasn't gotten any worse. Okay. Um, would be nice. So I'm going to say a recheck about the same time next week. Okay. What's up, dude? Hey, you. Huh? What?